Nice to meet Thank y'all. You. Hey guys, how you doing? What's up, man? Oh, how are you? Good to meet you. What's your name, sir? Uh, Raymond. Oh, Raymond. My God. Okay. Yeah. All right. God bless you, Raymond. Thank you so much. Well, this way. Okay. All right, guys. We get clear out this area. Yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Clear out this way, guys. Thank you. 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 Now here, I'm going to talk for like three minutes. Can you guys act like normal kids for three minutes? <laughs> no, Not going crazy? All right. First of all, it is wonderful to be here. Ms. Ale and Angelica, thank you so much for, for having us. Uh, thank you for your uh, incredible business, and thanks for being great leaders here in the community. Uh, it's, a, it's a great place, and we're thrilled to be here. I do think, unfortunately, you know, looking at the prices here, things are way too expensive. And they're way too expensive because of Kamala Harris's policies. I mean, look. Yes, buddy? You want some eggs? Yeah. Well, let's talk about eggs, because these guys actually eat about 14 eggs every single morning. Is that right? Yeah, I mean, Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. be careful about this. Um, eggs, when Kamala Harris took office, were short of $1.50 a, uh, a dozen. Now, a dozen eggs will cost you around $4, thanks to Kamala Harris's inflationary policies. Pennsylvania actually has seen some of the worst grocery price increases of the entire nation. And again, it's because she cast the deciding vote on the Inflation Explosion Act. I think we want Pennsylvanians to be able to afford groceries. We want our young families to be able to buy food at a reasonable price at the grocery store. And the only way to do that is to get back to common sense economic policies and fire Kamala Harris. This is a person who's presided over a thousand dollar increase in monthly uh, expenses. Just to afford the same life you could have afforded three and a half years ago, it costs you over a thousand dollars a month here in Pennsylvania. We can do so much better. We certainly will. And as the father of a couple of kids who eat a whole lot, we certainly need to do better for the next generation. God bless you guys. Thank you. All right, thank you, Russell. I don't, I don't, I don't think we're going to buy 24 eggs, though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, don't know how, I don't know how long you're going to travel. I can tell.